What's going on everybody? Hope you're being safe, wearing your masks. It's now mandatory in Illinois, so we're all wearing masks. We're all so lucky to be so close to each other, unified, they call it. Wear your mask, be safe. Today, getting right into the video, I'm gonna show you guys how to cut the top of your hair. Now I have a nickname, I call myself Edward Skizzer Hands because I'm real good with the skizzers by myself. I've never actually filmed this before, but let's get right into it. So you're gonna need a mirror, some skizzers, and a comb. Obviously you just saw me. You're gonna comb your shit to the side. Now when you look at my hair, you can see that I'm leaving the front lawn. Why am I leaving the front lawn? Well look, when you comb it back, this is the part that gets plumped, you know what I mean? So you need the front part to be a little longer, common sense. Now if you look, when I do it like this, it's mostly an undercut, but once I slick it, you can't even tell because you're fading into your hair. Remember that, watch my other videos. If you don't comprehend though, now, this is how I cut my hair and this is exactly how I would do it. I'm not a professional and I'm not going to be finishing it through this video because that would take too long, but this is how you start it and how you can get to the end. I'll show you real quick. Okay, so leaving this right here, you see it's a little longer. I'll cut just a little bit right there. That looks good. Very dapper. And then I'll move this out of the way and start right here. And I like to cut up at an angle. And I never stop cutting. And I try to make it all the way to the back. Okay? See? Easy peasy! Okay. Now let's comb it down again. You can see it's coming in. This is still a little long. So I'll go right here. All at an upward angle, not stopping. See? There, that's better. Okay. Now, I run my comb through it. This is where your trusty mirror comes in handy, just so I can see the back. I just follow my hair. See? Look at that. If I want it shorter, what do I do? I ignore this part, like I told you guys, and go right here. Look. And I don't stop. And don't worry if it's uneven. When you slick the hair, like the outsider that you are, it will all blend in. Look at that. Get the back. Try to get it even. These mirrors are literally five fucking dollars at Walmart. Don't forget your mask, pandemic, smart. Number one trick, right here. Don't go in like I tell you, flick this out. And you can blend right to it. See? You just flick it out and that helps you. Just makes it look a little bit better. And that's how you cut the top of your hair. No, I am not a professional. I've already mentioned that. Man, I got enough nipple hair. I don't need any more. This shit's gonna be sticky. But that's how you do it. I don't know what else I'm supposed to show you guys. I'm literally saving your lives during this quarantine. What the fuck else do you have to lose? Try to cut your hair. Cut the top of it. Comb it down. Then fade the fucking thing. Remember, look, you can just start fading. See? Just start fading. It doesn't matter. Start your line. Get it going. Very easy. Take these tips and use them. I'm not a YouTube influencer, social media influencer. Fucking look at me. I'm so much better influencer. I'm just trying to help you guys. So hopefully these videos help. And if you want a refresher, watch my videos. Leave the comments, concerns in the crotch area. Thank you to Hannah for filming me, as always. I'm trying to get back in the videos, so this is what you guys get. If you have ideas, crotch area. If you like the hair, like in the crotch area. It's all about the crotch, baby. Stay safe, stay healthy, keep the immune system up. Thanks for watching. I'll probably see you guys next week sometime. Bye. Yeah, and this is what I typically put down if uh, whenever I'm cutting my hair, especially with cutting the hair with the skizzers because it gets a lot of hair everywhere. And you don't want to be stepping in that because this shit is gross. Man. Yeah.